Italy is the birthplace of many of the game's finest defenders. Legends were forged on Serie A fields and their tales inspired the generations to come. That's why centre-backs and full-backs from all over the world come to Serie A. Take Kingsley Ezebue, who's been manning Udinese's right flank this season. Of course, when I was in Germany, when I was in Holland, I was following the Serie A always. And I really loved the competition and I'm really thankful to, to play here. To, and that the Udinese gave me the chance to, to play here in the Serie A. So that's really, I'm really thankful for that. But the Serie A has a lot of great fullbacks, um, like uh, Dan Fries, also a friend of mine. I would say I have Idoji, a teammate of mine. Yeah, I just see the I just see the qualities of him. He's, he's a really good player. Um, like the first, I know the first week I was like, wow, this guy is sprinting a lot. He's running back and forward, and I did it like two, three times, and I was already breathing heavily, and he was still going. I was like, yeah, it's it's a uh, it's a good thing to be honest. Serie A has always attracted extraordinary Dutch talents, those who inspired today's Orange contingent. Seydorf, I, I enjoyed this guy so, was so strong, physical, so good, but also technical, such a good player. And also uh, Stam, uh, Jaap Stam, he was also my coach in, uh, in Holland. So he really inspired me a lot. He teach me a lot of uh, also of defending, and I also always look up to him. He really has a strong, good aura. So if you if you look at him, you will almost get afraid of him, and then you still have to, you still have to pass him. The Dutch Nigerian fullback took some time to adjust to Serie A, but now he's playing a key role as Udinese seek to rediscover their early season sparkle. We well, said we we started great, and then we did a little dip, a little difficult moment. But um, but I see the thing is like we always believed in each other, and we will always keep going on. After some retiros that we had, um, we came we came back on the on the winning side to come up after such a dip. It only makes you stronger. Success. Once again, continues to bully Shaw Udoshie, and it's a tap in for Kingsley Hay. Zipwe at the back post. Milan look for the offside flag, but it didn't come. Of course, scoring goals always feels always feels good. But when I when I scored a goal against Milan, first I also thought it was offside. So, but um, yeah, when the referee gave me the clearance, I was I was really happy, relieved. Then you see like the hard work pays off. That's the so such a great moon as you know, a great feeling. Back in September, Udinese crushed Roma 4-0, one of their finest performances of the season. But this time they'll face them in front of a jam-packed Olimpico. I expect it's going to be a good, tough game. Um, because we, we play in Roma. Um, Roma is a team that you uh, don't, need, don't have to underestimate. Because they have, they have a lot of uh, qualities. They have some good players that can, they can do things. Demi Abraham, Pellegrini, Dybala. So they are uh, players that have good quality, but so do we. So it's going to be a good game.